How is miscible gas used in EOR? A key focus of BP's designer gas program is to optimize the properties of produced hydrocarbon gas by removing or adding other gases before injecting it back in the reservoir. This can dramatically improve oil recovery. Miscible gas is usually made of carbon dioxide or hydrocarbon gas or a mixture of both. It is one of the most effective EOR methods for pore scale displacement, typically displacing 95% of the residual oil that it comes in contact with. When miscible gas comes in contact with the oil, it exchanges components at the interface between the two, so the gas gets heavier and looks more like oil, and the oil gets lighter and looks more like the gas, until finally the interface disappears. The miscible performance of hydrocarbon gas can typically be improved by adding in more propane or butane. Here is an example of how miscible gas works. In a water-wet rock, the residual oil is trapped in the middle of the pores because it has lost its flow continuity. Miscible gas injection re-establishes that continuity by creating a new hydrocarbon flow path that enables the oil to flow out. When the miscible gas flood is finally stopped, water is injected to push the remaining gas out and gas takes the place of the residual oil in the pores while the oil is produced. Miscible gas, like normal gas, is still very mobile in the reservoir, so it is often injected alternately with water in a water-alternating gas or WAG process. The water slows the gas down and also sweeps the rock lower down in the reservoir that the gas might not reach. BP operates the world's largest hydrocarbon miscible gas flood at Prudhoe Bay in Alaska. What other gas EOR methods are there?